everybody, and welcome back. So this is just part of our little haul from this week at CVS. I hesitated showing you this video simply because you all are very familiar with these deals already, but I do know that you are enjoying the videos and I am getting very positive feedback and responses from you, so I thought I would go ahead and show you anyway, just in case some of you still have not taken advantage of these deals. You do have until Saturday night, so get on out there and get you some savings. We have been shopping a couple of different days this week, and so we do have several different transactions. Those of you who have been watching my channel know that I always try to put my ECBs to work for me, and so some of the things that I purchase may not necessarily be things that your family is interested in. It is just what seems to benefit us the best, but it may give you some ideas. So we will go ahead and start in with transaction number one. For our first transaction this week, we were able to find another CVS who still had some of the L'Oreal Youth Code BB Cream in stock. These are on clearance right now for 75% off. So if any CVS near you has these, run on out and pick them up. The great thing is, is that on coupons.com right now, there is a printable $3 off of one L'Oreal Skin Cream coupon available. You can print two coupons per computer. So if you have multiple computers or have a friend that has a computer that wouldn't mind printing you out a coupon, go ahead and grab all the coupons you can if this is a product you enjoy. My daughter and I love this product. It is a BB cream, so for those days that you don't want to wear a full and heavy foundation, this is just perfect for you. It adds just a little bit of color, a little bit of coverage, and it really does help maintain the health of your skin. We also plan on giving a few of these away to some of our friends. It was just too good of a deal to pass up. And we also were able to finally pick up the last little gel you seal that we have been waiting on. So here is how all of that looked on our receipt. You can see that all of the BB creams did ring up at 75% off. There we have our gel you seal. I did have a rain check for it, so it rang up at only $2.00. We presented all of our L'Oreal coupons. I had one for each BB cream that we purchased. I did have one $2 uh, coupon for the gel you seal, making that completely free. And I did have a $5 ECB that I had started the day with. That brought our subtotal to $4.92. We have to add our tax. So our total out of pocket on that was $6.97. But the cost of the L'Oreal before all coupons was over the $30 this week, so this did yield us back a $10 ECB. And it was just enough to get me over the next $50 mark in my beauty club, which will give me another $5 in ECB. So this actually ended up being a little bit of a money maker. For transaction number two, we did want to go ahead and take advantage of the dial deal. Our dial, our store was already out of most of the dial by the time that I got there. So I was only able to do the deal one time. I'm going to check another store in our town tomorrow morning. And if they are out of dial at that store as well, then I will be getting a rain check. This little bit of dial that I was able to get at my store was not enough yet to qualify me for the additional $10 gas card that is being given by Dial Rewards right now. You do have to spend $25 out of pocket. So when I go and I pick up the next set of six dial that will qualify me and I will be able to turn that receipt in. But we did want to go ahead and take advantage the best we could. Now the thing about the dial deal, if you were fortunate enough to have the coupons that were buy two, get one free. In essence, what you're going to do this week, since at CVS they are on sale, buy one, get one free. When you present those coupons, it is as though you are paying for one of these and getting the other five for free. Now that is on the body washes and the bar soap. 
The hand soaps are also buy one, get one free, but that is not included on the buy two, get one free coupon. There was a separate coupon that was for a dollar off of the purchase of two of those that I used for these hand soaps. So in essence, you're going to pay for one and get five free. But here's the good thing. If you have the Ibotta app on your phone, they are, there are three different dial rebates happening this week. One is for the regular dial soaps. One is for the dial for men. And the other is on bar soaps. That is how come I broke mine up and made sure that I purchased some in each category. Once you submit your receipt, you will get that $3 back. You are also going to get a 50 cent bonus for completing a triple play at a single store. And then you are also going to get a $1 bonus because you completed a dial deal that is happening on Ibotta. So it is a great way to compound your savings that made each of these less than $1 a piece once all of the rebates were applied. We also went ahead and picked up some Powerade. This week they are four for $5, but they are yielding back a $2 ECB, making those just 75 cents a piece. Of course, we got our gallon of milk. Those of you who watch my channel know that's pretty much a staple for us in a CVS haul. We did go ahead and pick up some of the candies that are counting towards the gas card this week. Our store was all out of the Lancaster except this single little bag. They are two for $6, and I had a $1 printable coupon that I was able to use for that little guy. When you only get one, it rings up $3. You do not have to get two to get the two for six special, and it is counting towards your gas. We had coupons again for buy one, get one free on the M&Ms, 75 cents off of two on the Snicker bars. This week, the vitamins at CVS are buy one, get one free. I had two $2 off of one coupons that were out of one of our Sunday circulars that I was able to use on that. And I also had another $2 off a $10 vitamin purchase from CVS. And then we also went ahead and picked up some of these M&Ms. They are also counting towards the gas card. They are buy one, get one free. There was a $1 coupon in the paper this past weekend, and there is also a $1 off of two that is printing from the CVS red box that you can combine with that. So here is how this order looked on paper. You will be able to see there all of the items that rang up free are free vitamins, the free M&Ms. Then you begin to see where we start in with the free Dial products, the buy one, get one freeze. All of the candy this week is buy one, get the second at 25 cents. So that is a great deal already, even without the coupons that we had. No deal on the milk this week. It is regular price. And you can see where we handed in all of our coupons there, the buy two, get one freeze. There is a maximum of $4.49 on that. So that is where they cut ours off. I did give them the $10 ECB that we earned on the L'Oreal from transaction number one. This brought our subtotal to $33.81. We paid $36.71 out of pocket, but it did earn us a $10 gas card. So when you deduct the value of this $10 in gas off of that, it is as though we really paid $26.71 which is not a bad price at all, considering that just one of our fish oils was $21.99 by itself. So this was an incredible deal and value for us this week. Now we are heading over into transaction number three with only the $2 ECBs that we were credited for the Power Aid purchase in transaction number Two, and we also did have coupons that were at coupons.com. Not sure if it's still available. Run on over and check it out. The coupon was for $3 off of the purchase of two Mars pouches. So you can see right here that we took great advantage of those. We got 12 bags of the candy pouches. They are on sale this week, two for $5, and they are counting towards the gas card. So at two for $5, if you purchase 12, that is enough to get you over 
the amount that you need for the gas card. And then you can see we applied our $2 ECB from transaction number two. We had all of the $3 coupons that we printed off and then we also had an additional coupon for the Snickers right down there that we were able to get from, actually I'm not even sure where we got that coupon from. That may have been one that printed from the CB, CBS Red Box. So that brought our total down to just $11.10, but this order by itself was enough to earn another $10 in gas. So when you look at it that way, we really got all of this candy for simply $1.10. And for those of you who enjoy candy or you have a little bit of a sweet tooth here's the neat thing if you were to pull over to your local convenience store and buy one candy bar you're going to pay anywhere from 99 cent to a dollar 79 depending on what size of candy bar you get these right here full little bag i believe that they are how many ounces here they are seven ounces each on those bags we got 12 of them for $1.10. So as it stands right now, my kids and my husband and I throughout the summer, if we hop in the car to want to go somewhere, we will just grab us a little pouch of candy and take it with us to save the expense of stopping at a convenience store. And it did get us a $10 gas card. When these transactions were all said and done, they had a total value of $328.49. We paid $54.78 out of pocket, saving us $273.71. And then we also did earn $4.75 back in the Ibotta rebates. When we include the rebate savings to our out-of-pocket savings, we had 85% savings on this haul. So these are just a few of the deals that we have taken advantage of already at CVS this week. We will be heading back to see if we can get some more of the dial soap. I just want to encourage you, don't forget if you're taking advantage of the dial deal this week, don't forget to include your Ibotta rebates. And don't forget to go to dialrewards.com to cash in for your additional $10 gas card. You can earn that on top of the one you are already earning at CVS, and so it does compound your savings. Overall, there are some great deals to be had at CVS this week. This is the Frugal Rev saying, go get you some savings. Thanks for watching.